Welcome to 171 Allen Street. This house is a three plus one bedroom, four bathroom house in the heart of Port Perry. As we walk into the front foyer, you see this handcrafted staircase and some people may be wondering what the secret is with these stairs. These stairs were bullnosed with hockey sticks and the fourth stair up is a stick belonging to Bobby Orr. To the left of the front door is a large living room with sparkling hardwood floors. And to the right of the entrance is a beautiful dining room with a lovely cathedral ceiling up to the second story. Continuing on, we get into the kitchen which has all refinished cabinetry, all newly done. Beautiful granite countertop. Very large family size kitchen. A big pantry for storage. And the kitchen has a walkout to the new deck in the private backyard. The yard, as you can see, overlooks the green space behind and there is a pond back there as well. Lots of wildlife, uh, actually you can see right there, um, a dove out in the yard. So as we continue through, this is the first bathroom. You can see it's a two-piece, again, with refinished cabinetries, new sink, and then we go a little further and we get into the family room. Family room has a gas fireplace, very large. It's got durable hardwood flooring. It's Armstrong laminate. Nice big windows, again, overlooking the backyard and the green space behind. Going back to the foyer and up the stairs. On the right is the master bedroom. Oh, and if you happen to be here during a showing, the cat is Molly. She's very friendly, a little bit shy. She'll probably hide if you come in. Walk-in closet. Lots of floor space. As you can see, this is quite a big bedroom set. And uh, there's room for more furniture if you wanted it. And another newly refinished bathroom. This has a, a walk-in shower. Nice clean surround, modern. Carrying on, we get to the main bathroom, which is on the second floor. And this is a four piece. Again, with a new modern tub. And as we venture a little further, we're going to get into the second bedroom. This is a very large room, very bright. This is actually my favorite room in the house. Uh, nice big uh, furniture in this room. So again, you can see that there's a lot of floor space. Closet. 
And then we come into the third bedroom, which again is quite large. Lots of floor space in here. Big, big closet. This bedroom overlooks that green space that I mentioned. Lots of nice privacy. And this is a view down from the second floor into the dining room. I should mention that this home has uh, newer siding. The siding was replaced in 2014 and there was extra insulation added behind the siding so the R value is quite a bit higher than um, many of the homes in this neighborhood. We're heading down into the basement. Um, some of the basement is unfinished. Uh, you've got a nice big uh, storage room here to the left and just around the corner we've got this little three-piece bathroom nothing fancy but it's good for the kids and as you continue you get to this wonderful family room this family room has seen lots of good times in it with families and children Quite big, it's got a drop ceiling, some windows, keeps it bright. And then we get to the fourth and final bedroom, which again is a good size room. Double bed size. It's got a nice big walk-in closet. There's more storage down there, furnace, utility area. I'll go up the stairs. We'll pop into the backyard. Oh, dove's still there. You can see the backyard's very peaceful. Fix that cushion. Very peaceful backyard. The deck is brand new. Nice large deck. There is access from the garage to the backyard, so that's very handy. There is a gas line running out for the barbecue. But just a lovely spot to sit during the summer with the trees. Watch the animals at the bird feeder. through the kitchen. Hope you've enjoyed the tour.